Imagine receiving an email saying you've been accepted to Columbia University only to find out it was a mistake. Yeah, that's what happened in nearly 280 applicants. And now the university is apologizing. CBS 2's Aaron Logan has more. Getting an acceptance letter to college is something to be ecstatic about, but to then be told you didn't get accepted? Some people are very upset. I think it depends on the person. Columbia University officials confirmed that 277 incorrect acceptance letters were sent out Wednesday to applicants for the School of Public Health's master's program. If I were a student that received that letter, I definitely would have been upset, but I feel like these things happen at universities, and I really don't know what type of you know, reprieve the university would, would allow for because, I mean, they can't accept them if, you know, the original decision was to be that they weren't accepted. The mistake was noticed immediately, and university officials say within an hour, apology emails were sent out to all 277 applicants. There's still that hour that you probably told everyone you know, you told your friends, you put it on Facebook, and then, oops didn't happen. That's so incredibly heartbreaking. I'm very sad to hear that that happened to people. Fashikan, a third year medical student, and Wang, an undergrad student, have slightly different perspectives. Wang says the mistake would have hurt a lot more if these letters were sent to high school students entering college. Fashikan says it hurts either way, but things happen for a reason. I kind of believe that people end up where they're meant to be, and even if it's not at Columbia. University officials sincerely apologize and say they're working to strengthen the internal procedures to make sure this does not happen again. In Washington Heights, Aaron Logan, CBS 2 News. Yeah, that's a tough one. Columbia, by the way, isn't the first institution to make this mistake. Last spring, it happened at the University of Buffalo. In 2015, it happened at Carnegie Mellon in Pittsburgh. And in 2013, Fordham University mailed out 2,500 acceptance letters prematurely.